rest, no, I don't back down. Leave your heart laying on the ground. Tell me who the killer now. Tell me who the killer. Hello, my stars and galaxies. Welcome back to my channel, The Universe Terry. Or if you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel, The Universe Terry. Okay. Um, no, you're like, y'all probably haven't seen me for a good 24 hours ish or more, but you know, you know, guys, people gotta take a vacay day, you know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but like, there will be like one day out of the whole month, I just will not upload anything at all, you know? So maybe that's not good because YouTube will be like, oh, you're not uploading? Okay. But you know, I just needed it, you know? Energy was kind of low, but now we're back. Energy is higher than ever. We're back. So yeah. Um, and it was probably for the best anyway. I was kind of, I was kind of a little bit overbooked with so many different appointments. So it was probably for the best anyway that I didn't upload. I just could just get to focus on the appointments. Okay. So we're back at it. Got got, got you guys some new messages today. Let's do this real quick. I don't know if it was too far to the right or something like that. But yeah. Um, so yeah. Um, today is all about the Scorpio. Okay. Hence the title right i just like to say it so i can know in my so i know in my head in my heart in my soul that it's for the scorpio 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 okay anyway um so first things first make sure you guys like that video hit that like button right now okay hit it right now right right now let's go let's go let's go let's go all right good now subscribe you know, if you haven't already, well, a lot of you are already, the people who do watch me all the time, I appreciate y'all. If you are already subscribed, then you're good, okay? But if you're not subscribed, but you, and this is your first time, first time watching me, just go subscribe for me right now, okay? Or if you still, if you make it to halfway into this video, subscribe. You should have also subscribed already, okay? Then hit that post notification bell, all right? Hit that post notification bell, okay? And share the video so it can go out to a wider audience, Okay. Um, what's another thing? Oh yeah, personal reading prices. Okay. Personal reading prices. Okay. Um, for a one question reading, right? It's going to be fifteen dollars on Cash App and twenty on PayPal. Okay. 15 on Cash App, $20 on PayPal. Alrighty. Um, and how the one question works, for those who don't know, um, the one question reading is the shortest, you know, because again, it's just one question. Um, uh, it's usually anywhere between four and five minutes, okay? Because I don't waste no time on those one questions, you know? Just boom, four or five minutes in long, you know, I just draw three cards to answer your question. All right? Simple as that. Um... Then for a 10 minute reading, it's 25 on Cash App, 30 on PayPal. Okay. For a 20 minute reading, it's 40 on Cash App, 45 on PayPal. Then for a 30 minute reading, it's $50 on Cash App and 55 on PayPal. Okay. So just let you know that. Okay, just let me know that, you know. Um so and then oh, but I gotta let you guys know, please do not, do not send me any money unless we have confirmed your appointment okay do me that favor hold on y'all there's a mosquito bug in here okay y'all so we got that out the way now yeah there was a nasty little mosquito bug in here um so but got him mm -hmm. i have to wonder how did they get in the house i don't even know how maybe you know we open a door close the door so many times that's probably why but anyway um yeah, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, do not send any money unless we have confirmed your appointment. Please do that favor for me, okay? Um, you know, so I just don't want anyone to get overbooked. You know, and because it, it's inconvenient for me if you guys send me your money and there's people ahead of you, okay? So fine, you sent me your money. There's no way, there's nothing I can do about it now. Um, but you know, just keep in mind that you're not going to get, you may, you may not get your appointment immediately because again, there's most likely somebody ahead of you. Okay. And sometimes when I do it, even when I do their appointment, they pay for a longer one. Okay. They do, they do things. I'm not, uh, I like, I don't put out there like say, Hey, Hey, how much would you charge me for one hour? One or an hour and a half? One? Like people have done that. 
and I'm just like okay you know so that's what I'm saying do not stress me out by sending your money sooner than you need to okay then membership is available on my channel okay there's a link in the description box right that will what you call it take you right to the membership page where you will see three different um what you call it three different packages right now the universe package right is the most convenient one for your money because it's 9.99 a month and you are what you call it getting so many other perks okay and then you get five dollars knocked off your personal reading okay mm -hmm. the only downside of this is that they don't shuffle that well okay so hope everyone's having a good morning and good night hope all is well but if all is not well i do apologize hopefully your situation will get better okay so all right okay listen to what your heart tells you scorpio mm -hmm. this doesn't even have to be just for the scorpio this, this doesn't that, that's not even something just for the uh exclusively just for the scorpio that's with everybody with a heart okay that's with everybody with a heart okay so listen to what your heart tells you okay right whatever it is you feel whatever it is you're you're thinking whatever it is you that you feel like is going on right that's your intuition okay right that's your intuition okay now some people may see your pay your but you say you're being paranoid and this and that you know you're just making accusations or whatever maybe you are okay but again, that's your body. But, but we, don't we have a body intuition for a reason? Don't we have an intuition for a reason? That's our gut feeling. Okay, that is our gut feeling, or that's our intuition. That's having. That's like that's our ability. That's kind of our sort of. That's kind of sort of our sixth sense, you know, because that's our ability to guess situations or feelings or news without actually being told okay right so that's kind of sort of our sixth sense sometimes it's right sometimes it's wrong but you know that's you know it's kind of our like our 50 50 into it um 50 50 superpower okay our gamble let's say a gamble superpower all right okay focus only on you okay so maybe somebody's just stressing you out somebody's just getting on your nerves somebody's um like playing ring around the rosy with your emotions or your thoughts or your body and you're just so tired of it so the inner divine energy is saying to focus only on you all right focus only on you okay someone's i feel my stomach growling for hunger <laughs> i got you i got you stomach but anyway yeah focus only on wheel focus on your career your finances don't worry about what other people are doing okay focus on you focus on what you need to be doing all right hmm. we're both hurting from this okay so i'm seeing here in a situation where you guys are involved in, in a um a situation that's not benefiting either one of you right right now it's doing more harm than good Right? But I'm seeing here it's most likely because there's not any communication. There's no proper communication. Okay? Right? Like, yeah, you guys are talking, right? But that doesn't mean you're agreeing on a certain subject or seeing eye to eye on a certain situation. Okay? So you guys are definitely both hurting from this. You guys are definitely getting irritated from the situation. You more than them because they don't really see what you're going through mentally. Okay? Mm-hmm. Always pay attention to your person's red flags, okay? This can be with anybody. Friend, family member, stranger on the street, romantic partner, anybody, okay? President. <laughs> but yeah, you know, just letting you guys know that. Um, always, pay always pay attention to the people's red flags around you. This could be, like, again, even a stranger on the street, you got to watch out for the red flags, okay? All right? So you just gotta be aware of that, you know. Maybe because you know, and it's a lot of things. A lot of times, a lot of times, 
people are good at covering up their red masks. I mean, red masks, red flags, but maybe like humor or they just shut people out and stuff like that, et cetera, et cetera. So people are good at covering up their red flags or just, you know, or like this, some people just go good at covering up their red flags, you know, and thinking that they're, you know, they're all, they're, they're all that in a bag of chips, right? So when you get to know them, when you get into a situation where you can't escape from them, that's when, you know, that's when the red flags come out and you didn't even see that. Okay, you didn't even see that. So that's why it's still it's especially important to really just keep an eye out. Okay. Well, that exploded a little bit. Excuse me one second, y'all. It's breakfast time. <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank God I picked it up, so I don't have to get up. Hmm. Good. It tastes like um the vanilla pudding. It tastes like vanilla pudding. Okay. Hmm. I miss the fun we used to have. Okay. This could really go for both of you. Okay. Maybe you could. Maybe you missed the the fun that y'all used to have, or they missed the fun that you used to have, or it could be mutual, mutual feeling. Right. It could be a mutual feeling. You know what I'm saying? And. Nothing's really wrong with that. Okay? Nothing's really wrong with that. Nothing's wrong with, um, what you call it? Nothing's wrong with, like, missing the good times, right? Nothing's wrong with that, okay? But what is important is that if you guys ever want that again, there's some serious communication that would really have to happen. There's some serious work that would really have to happen in your relationship. Okay? Something like that would, there have to be some serious effort to fix what was lost or broken. Okay. I wish we never happened. Ooh, okay. So, someone wish I wish that this never happened, okay? So, when I'm Scorpio, I'm getting the feeling it's most likely you that wish that y'all never happened. Okay? You most likely wish that they, like, this never happened. Okay. And you know what? It's totally valid. It's totally valid. You know, you regret being with that person. You regret meeting them or whatever case you regret just being with them or just being associated with them. It's okay. You know, everyone's entitled to their feelings. Everyone's entitled to, um, you know, what's going on or how they feel. Everyone's entitled to their own emotions. Okay. So, Scorpio, if that's the way you feel, you do not have to be associated with them anymore. Okay? You can just be like, hey, I don't want any more contact, and I just want to live my life. Okay? Hell, you can do that without even telling them. Mm -hmm. I left when things got hard. Okay? So your person abandoned you when things got hard, all right? That's most likely where the hurt is coming from, okay? And they feel guilty. They feel bad about the whole situation, okay? Maybe, yeah, they definitely left because things got hard and, you know, maybe they're, com they're coming back to be like, hey, you know, I'm, I'm sorry. You know, I miss, I miss the fun that we used to have. And blah, 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 blah. But... What about going through the hardships, okay? Because let me tell you something. Hardships are never fun. I'll tell you right now. Hardships are never fun, okay? Especially if, you know, you're married and it's taking a toll on your marriage. Okay? You know, that's never fun. However, okay, a real partner, okay, a real partner stands with you through the hardships, right? And not just the fun times, okay? We all, we all want just, no, no one wants bad things to happen in their relationship, right? But real partners, whether it's boyfriend and girlfriend or husband and wife or same-sex relationships, right? You know, the, the true, the, 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 what you call it? It's the, the real part, the real true part is that, you know, standing by your partner, having, having their back, showing that you care, and stuff like that, okay? That's where, that's where um, that trust and loyalty comes in.
okay? They didn't do that for you, so you feel abandoned. You feel left. You feel left and abandoned, Scorpio. I failed to give you what they need, what you needed. They sure did. They sure did. Okay. They sure did. And let me tell you something. Okay. Let me tell you something right now, Scorpio. Even though they're guilty, even though they're probably making you want to come back, I'm seeing here that you have to act like you really have a lot of self doubt about letting them back into your life. So, you know, I can say, oh, you know, you may let them back into your life if you want to, or oh, no, don't let them back into your life, okay? Now, I could say that, all right? I could, right? But at the end of the day, y'all are going to do what y'all want to do, okay? Y'all are going to do whatever you want to do, right? So instead of saying either one of those things, I'm going to be like, all I'm going to say is remember that car that came out earlier. Pay attention to your person's red flags. Okay? Remember that car. If they have the tendency to hurt you and then you guys separate, some time passes, they come back crawling on their feet for forgiveness if that's their tendency that if that's the, what they do often you definitely got to keep that in mind okay you definitely got to remember that okay i need more time to think scorpio needs more time to think mm. listen nine to, no Eight times out of ten. Eight times out of ten. When somebody says, I need more time to think, it's more likely that they may come to you. Okay, you they may come back to you. So Scorpio, you're probably thinking about coming back to them, okay? Probably. Like your heart probably your heart probably saying, Oh, give them another chance, you know. Give them another chance. Give them another chance. But your brain is like, girl, is you crazy? Boy, is you crazy? If you don't get up out of there, you know, that's a lot of time. That's what happens when we need to think. When we're dead set sure about something, we can make a decision like that. But when we're having a hard time, when we're having pros and cons within our, within inside ourselves, that's why we need more time to think, okay? Because our brain says one thing and our heart says one thing, okay? Right? And the heart is more locked in because the heart is well figuratively um like the feelings for somebody okay well, yeah 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 logically you know the feeling of love or catch or catching feelings comes from the brain but you know i'm talking about you know figuratively okay not logically like figuratively like oh you know your heart is locked on to that person you know what i'm saying yeah yeah i know it all was school all of us in school we used to believe the heart was the, the the source of your emotions but no 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 it's the brain but yeah logically figuratively figuratively let's just say the heart is locked on to that person with feelings okay and the brain is more you know the buzz kill let's just say that okay so you're no you need more time to think scorpio maybe just to get your head on straight before you make any rash decisions right but you have to remember that this person seems to do this a lot okay or they seem to do it often okay they make all these mistakes so when they make a one specific particular mistake and realize they effed up that's when they want to apologize but when they do all these little things and there's no major consequences they try to justify the reason why they did it okay and then, then it's just an endless cycle, okay? That's why I said earlier, you're hurting from the situation more than they are, okay? All right, romantic feelings. You guys see what I'm saying here? It's an endless cycle. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Guys, it's an endless cycle. I'm telling you right now, okay? It's an endless cycle. Wait, did this flip over? Oh. Yeah, it's an endless cycle of romantic feelings and catching feelings and this and that and this, that, and the third, right? It's an endless feeling of that, okay? Nothing's wrong with having romantic feelings, right? Nothing's wrong with still having feelings for that person, okay? But you can, but you gotta ask yourself, what's more important, your love for them or your self-love, 
What's more important? Honest to God. Okay? I'm going to give you guys a minute to reflect on that. Okay, reflecting's over. You can still reflect after you watch this video, you know what I'm saying? You can still reflect, you know? But right now, you know, that was just to, you know, marinate what I just said. Woo! I am not waiting on you anymore. <laughs> That's so... Future, what you looking at? Anyway, but yeah. Um, like I was saying, I'm not waiting on you anymore. That is what I like to hear. Okay? Not waiting on your ass no more. Okay? So, you're tired of being hurt by this person. Okay? You're tired of being hurt by this person. You're tired of being betrayed. You're tired of having your time wasted. Okay? And you're tired of just being used whenever it's convenient for them. Okay? You're tired of all of it. You're tired of all of it, okay? So, you're coming to tell your person that, hey, you know, we did have good times and we also had the bad times. The bad times outnumber the good times. So, I can't do this anymore with you. I'm done with you. You know, you got to do what you got to do on your own now. You know, you got to you gotta do whatever you want to do this time without me, okay? And this is good. If they want to be saltier in their feelings about it, good. Bye. You know, feel how you feel about it, okay? But meanwhile, this, this person, Scorpio, is going to live their life, okay? Oh, but I should also say, this could also go in the reverse, right? Like how earlier you guys said you needed more time to think, okay? Or the divine energy was telling you you felt like you needed more time to think. This could also go in the reverse, right? Meaning like this person's done waiting for your answer, they're done waiting for you to respond, for you to give them a straight answer. Like you're supposed to, like you tell them that, on, let's say on Monday, and they're supposed to give you an answer by tomorrow, okay? See, that's just a red flag right there. Right? That's what I'm saying. It can also go in the reverse. Like, you're not, like, dealing with them anymore. But that also means that they're not dealing with the waiting anymore. They want an immediate answer. Right? And even and, and even if you, if you give them an answer that they don't like, they're probably going to bash you on social media or give you this long-ass text message about, you know, oh, you're a piece of crap. You know, you're wasting my time. You know, I regret getting in a relationship with you. So, you know, whatever. Bye. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. You just don't care. Okay? You just don't care. We all know what that means. Okay? This person just don't care. Right? Because, see, let me tell you something, y'all. I'm not a marriage... Marriage therapist or relationship therapist or any kind of therapist at all you know or um but you don't have to be that to know that this person got issues okay you don't gotta be any kind of therapist or specialist to be to know that this relationship is a, a is, is almost a dumpster fire okay it's not a dumpster fire it's just a trash can fire so yeah let's just say that Okay, you don't got to be any kind of specialist to know that or say that. Okay, right? This is just what genuinely is going on, right? And that's okay. Every relationship has problems. Okay, every relationship has its thing got uh, has its thing going on, has um, situations going on, right? Every relationship does. Okay but you don't have to be a part of something like that okay you want a meaningful relationship you want something special with somebody this person's not going to provide that okay they're not going to provide the special thing that you want okay you want happiness you want love you want honesty you want something good and great okay everybody does okay but just keep in mind that you cannot get that with this person so it's important that you move on without them in your life Okay, I'm struggling to find a new path in life, okay? 
right? So Scorpio, maybe you're having a hard time right now to get your head on straight, find something new. Sorry, y'all. I had to cut the video because um I don't know what happened to the iPhone. There was just this noise and then it totally stopped. It was like this, and you know, it totally stopped. Eh, got to get a new phone. Um, but anyway, like I was saying, I'm struggling to find a new path in life. So yeah, you. So now you're wondering. You're probably wondering. Oh, so what am I going to do now? You know, this person's not in my life now. What am I going to do? How am I going to manage? You're going to manage the exact same way you did with or without them. Okay? Mm-hmm. You're going to do the exact same thing you were doing without them. What do you mean, what are you going to do? What do you mean? You're going to continue to live your life like you've been normally doing. All right? Or maybe you're wondering, where do you go from here? Okay? Well, that's really something more for you to find out, okay? You know, that's see, but this is good. This is good. To opportunity to do some soul searching, okay? Opportunity to do some um, finding for yourself. Find some, um, 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 what do you call it? Some interest in your life. Find out who Scorpio is. Say your name is Mark. Find out who Mark is, okay? Say so you're a muscle so Mark. If there's any Marks out there watching, Mark, um, you know, just... What you call it? Um, look inside yourself. Ask yourself what you want. You know, venture out. Find something that you find interesting and then do that. You know, stuff like that. You know, this is an opportunity to do so much with yourself. You focus on your career, your finances, your your love. No, not you. Well, I mean, yeah, your love, new love life. You know what I'm saying? Or, you know, just focus on your single life. Hey, no one. And another thing. Another thing. Let's normalize being single. Okay. Let's normalize being single because nothing is wrong with being single. If anything, that's less of a headache. Okay? You know, there's pros and cons to being single and there's pros and cons to being in a relationship. Okay? Um, but yeah, just take your time and do what you got to do. There's no rush, really. Oh, I let you go because I needed space. Okay? All right? For a lot of you, do you let them go then because so you can be alone and... Um, just get some space, get some distance between y'all so you guys don't have to um, deal with each other again, right? Hey, stop the licking. My dog's licking himself. You know, he when he licks, it's so loud and so gross and so squelchy that it's just like, ugh. Right? So, yeah. You know, anyway. Finally getting my dog out my face. Anyway. Yeah, you had to let them go because they were just, you know, a mess. You had to let them go. Otherwise, you would lose your sanity, right? Look, this person can feel however they want to feel about you, do whatever they want to do, right? But at the end of the day, you have to think about what's best for you, okay? You have to do what's best for you. You got to do what's best for your mental health, okay? Mental health is so crucial, y'all. Mental health is so crucial. That's why you got to go ahead, take your time, do what you got to do, okay? And what you had to do was let this person go. And nothing is wrong with that, okay? Now, stay optimistic about your love life, right? This person is not the only person you're ever going to meet, okay? You're not the only person you're ever going to meet, okay? That's why it's very important that you take your time, do what you got to do, do what you need to do, do what's necessary for your health, Okay, and just really look out for the person that's really right for you. Okay, don't just be with them just cause. Don't be with them cause you know maybe you felt desperate. Blah, 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 huh? But no, don't do that. Okay, Scorpio, you are beautiful. You're handsome. You're special. You're awesome. Don't settle for less. Okay, always get what you deserve. Okay, don't be an entitled douche. Okay. But always treat yourself with love and respect, okay? So if you're going to treat yourself with love and respect, you're gonna, you deserve somebody who's going to give you back that same love and respect that you give yourself, all right? So clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now, which is a very important life lesson for very many different people, okay? Especially for those who are indecisive, who tend to be indecisive, okay? Clearly decide what you want so that it'll come to you now, right? 
So, Scorpio, my name, you mean, some people don't know what they want, but you need to know what you want, okay? It's very important that you know what you want, you know exactly what you want in life, what you're really looking for. When you do that, everything will just come so easier, you know? Think about what you want, think about what you're looking for, think, you, think about what you're trying to achieve, and then just let yourself make that kind of decision, okay? Just do that, love yourself, honor yourself, and, and, and just really think clearly about what you need to do and where you want to go from a certain point, okay? So Scorpio, I hope this did resonate with you. I hope this helped in any way, you know, a nice little comeback for the, well, it's the 2nd of September now, but, you know, a little comeback for the start of the month, you know what I'm saying? So, I um, hope you guys like the video, share, subscribe, and hit that post notification bell so you don't miss an upload when I upload, all right? And if it did not resonate with you, just please, you know, buy a personal reading so it can resonate with you. I love to please all my fans. Now, just keep in mind to just show me some love later on. Show me some love. Like, you know, no. Show me some love from here to all the way to later on until this channel dies, okay? Right? So, this has been the Universe Terry. Namaste.